In a healthy body, the immune system serves as a powerful defense against foreign invaders and host cells that are undergoing malignant transformation. However, the rise of malignancy suggests that the dynamics of the immune system have been compromised and suppressed. Due to these immunosuppressive effects, there is an immediate need for new targeted therapies to help bring the immune system back online. Bavituximab is an investigational immunotherapy that is believed to activate the body's immune system to recognize and kill cancer cells. Bavituximab's target, phosphatidylserine, or PS, is a phospholipid found on the interior side of the plasma membrane of all healthy cells. As a cell dies a natural death, PS flips to the exterior of the membrane. PS is a highly immunosuppressive molecule. When PS becomes exposed on the outside of the membrane, it engages PS receptors on immune cells and signals them not to attack dying cells. This allows the body to remove the cells without prompting an inflammatory response. Cancer exploits this natural upstream immune checkpoint to promote tumor growth. High levels of PS are exposed on cells in the tumor environment. Debris shed from tumor cells, known as microvesicles, also display numerous PS molecules. This exposed PS is engaged by PS receptors on immune cells leading to the secretion of immunosuppressive cytokines, including TGF-beta and IL-10, from tumor-promoting myeloid-derived suppressor cells, or MDSCs, and M2 macrophages. Furthermore, the immunosuppressive environment driven by exposed PS inhibits dendritic cell maturation and prevents the development of tumor-specific cytotoxic T-cell responses. The tumor is then able to grow unimpeded by the immune system, where it is supported by the local environment. Bavituximab is an investigational monoclonal antibody developed by Peregrine that targets this upstream immune checkpoint and is believed to override PS-mediated immunosuppressive signaling in tumors. After targeting exposed PS, bavituximab engages FC gamma receptors on MDSCs, M2 macrophages, and immature dendritic cells, leading to multiple immunostimulatory changes in the tumor. This includes an increase in immunostimulatory cytokines, including TNF-alpha and IL-12, macrophage polarization from an M2 to a tumor-fighting M1 state, and the differentiation of tumor-promoting MDSCs into M1 macrophages and mature dendritic cells. M1 macrophages then contribute to tumor destruction through antibody-dependent cellular cytotoxicity, or ADCC, while mature dendritic cells present tumor antigens to T-cells, inducing tumor-specific cytotoxic T-cell responses. Published studies show that the upstream checkpoint blockade mediated by Peregrine's PS-targeting antibodies mobilizes the immune system to fight cancer by activating innate and adaptive anti-tumor immune responses.